Jimmy Donovan standing by live with that. Jimmy ought to be 20 years old. He'll be picked in the first round of the NFL draft by the Cleveland Browns. Not a bad day. All right, Russ and Laura, here we are back inside First Energy Stadium. It is a beautiful night. It's crisp and it's cool, bordering on cold, but it's very exciting. Big crowds here throughout the afternoon, and they are swelling as we go through the evening. Rounds two and three coming up in this NFL draft tonight. But we go back to round number one, and boy, the Browns are thrilled to be able to welcome this young man, Greg Newsom into the fold as the quarterback coming to the Browns with the number 26 overall pick in the first round. A three-year starter, all Big Ten, all-American cornerback out of Northwestern. A guy that the Browns were just kind of wringing their hands as the draft kept coming to them at 26, that he'd still be on the board and they'd be able to get him. And boy, it didn't take long. Once it was open, that their pick was up. Greg Newsom was on the board. They made the pick right away. And I would say Greg Newsom is not short on confidence. Listen. Well, to get word on, I think I should have gone with my confidence that I tell you I should have went to Jacksonville at one. I mean, that's, but that's just how confident I am as a player. Um, and, you know, there's a lot of great players out here, but that's kind of how I've always held myself to. Like, there, I don't think there's any player better than me, um, but I don't think I'm better than any player as well. So I, I, I try to keep that same, you know, that same confidence every every way I go. So. See, what I tell you? He's a confident kid. You like that in a cornerback. Now, will he play right away? I'll tell you what, when you pick a cornerback at number 26 in the first round of the NFL draft, the plan is you get him on the field as soon as possible. But what about Greedy Williams, you say? Well, Williams will compete now with Greg Newsom, with Denzel Ward on the other side. And the Browns secondary just got a lot better last night. And I think we we're all a little bit worried about it going into the season if they weren't able to make a move like the one they made last night. Now, what about tonight? A pick in the second round, two in the third round. The Browns might finally go offense. Remember, this offseason in free agency and what they did last night, it's been all defense. Maybe it's time to go onto the other side, the offense. I'd be looking for the Browns at some point tonight to get a wide receiver. And last year, on the second night of the draft, which is where we are this year now on the Friday night version of it. That's when Andrew Berry, the Browns general manager, started to make moves. And by moves, I mean he traded up in the second round to get Grant Delpit. So that could be in play, that the Browns start to move around in this draft. It could come tonight. That's the scene here at First Energy Stadium. Russ, big night once again. Busy night for the Browns. Busier than last night. All right, Jimmy. See you later in sports. Thank you.